Hey guys, welcome back to Creeping Terror. In the last episode, we met our cast of characters. Arisa, who is a student from Japan studying abroad, I'm guessing here in America. Her friend Emily. Her brother Bob. And uh, apparently Arisa's love interest, Ken. We got separated from everyone. We found Emily, found a big old minor monster, which I am officially naming the Minor 49er for shits and giggles, because why not? <laughs> and now we're going to go looking for Bob and Ken. Emily already went ahead. There was a note right here. I'm hearing a voice inside my head. I didn't pay attention to it before, since it was just murmurs, but lately, I've been able to hear it very clearly. <sighs> Maybe I'm tired. I have been pretty busy. I should find time to go visit the doctor for a checkup. Out we go. Let's start searching. March 18th, 2016. Remains found in the mountains. 19 bodies were located within the... I'm getting Fatal Frame 2 flashbacks. <laughs> within the... Oh, what should I do for those? I'm gonna Mad Libs this shit. March 18th, 2016. Remains found in mountains. 19 bodies were located within the sponge in the mountains of Northern Hell. Police uncovered a shovel at the crime scene, believed to be the murder weapon. A violent confrontation may have also occurred, as fires and bite marks cover the bodies. As signs of Pepsi usage were spotted at the scene, investigators are attempting to determine if there is a connection between this event and the recent incident. Ooh. Okay. Oh, there's stairs there. It's really dark in the mansion. Stairs. Going down, probably. Ah, I found a hiding spot under the table. September 2015. Monster encounter reported by Ida Berth from... Ida found herself lost in the woods and accidentally stumbled upon a gigantic monster with a bizarre appearance. She hid in the shadows and the monster eventually disappeared. Reports say there were traces of digging in the area was sighted. More rations. And now I know a hiding spot. Locked. Stairs it is, then. Let's head down these stairs first. Rations inventory full. Alright, um... Can I do anything to mark? No. I'll just have to try and remember that those are there.
so dark. Unfortunately, I can't adjust the brightness. There was no brightness in the options. A note! My memories of the past few years have been getting fuzzy lately. How did I get here again? No, wait, why am I here? Oh, 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 oh! Note! The mansion that I inherited after my father passed apparently used to be the headquarters of a cult. Oh, great! Isn't that lovely? Not only that, father himself seemed to be deeply involved with him. True, I've been estranged from him since I left home, but he was never the sort of person to do such a thing. What could have possibly changed him so much? <laughs> So, monster running around. Colt used to be in this place. Lovely! Another hiding spot. Good. As far as I know, there's no true ending to this. As far as I know. Nope, nope, nope. We're not gonna have another... Another... Let me read this first. Someone please help! My grandchild is going to die at any moment! The doctors claim it's an illness for which they cannot find the cause, and there's nothing they can do! I have no choice but to try to... Try the drug I found at that place. Oh dear. There's a lot of different things in here. Huh. Is this some kind of bone? <gasps> what? Why is a dog here? <laughs> what should I do? Oh, I'll use this bone. <sighs> Now's my chance to... What? No. No way. Run! <sighs> I'm safe now. Right? <sighs> Why is the monster I saw in the mine shaft here? Wonder if the others are okay. Ah! What was that? What was that sound? It came from the direction I came from. I'm scared, but I should really see what it was. There we go. Shouldn't be a problem now. Piece of wood. Inventory full. There's stairs. Uh, I guess this door is locked from the other side. Good to know. It says to examine the second floor, so we do need to go backwards a bit. through here now. I wonder if the monster destroyed it. Doesn't matter. 
I can keep going ahead. Actually, before we do... I want to head back to the safe room. Also, there's the room that I ended up falling in. In case I need to throw a rock. This is the mansion entrance. Whoops! Ha! Huh. Oh, that's a charger. Oh my god, it's too bad I can't mark places. That'd be really helpful. Ooh, wait a minute, I just got an idea. But, till then, let's move on. There's doors here too. There's doors everywhere. Bones. In case that dog comes back. Floor storage key. And the note. I fell asleep with the window open and ended up bitten multiple times by bugs. I knew there were rivers nearby which could bring swarms of bugs, so I tried to take precautions. Apparently I didn't do enough. Ugh, they're incredibly itchy. Swelling is only getting worse. I better tell my children to make sure I to keep the door sh doors and windows shut. Okay, so we got a key. That's a start. gonna need to have a standoff with him first and then run away yeah Come on!
I got a key for the first floor. Let's go unlock the door. Speed. I came here for a glass bead? Where does it go? I've pretty much explored everywhere. item. Oh! Oh, 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 oh! The balcony! Birds are attracted to it. The closest place I could think of where we can get to any place with birds is the balcony on the second floor. to look it up. I'm, I'm sorry. But I'm not ashamed to uh, try and find... I only go as far as what I need to find out. I don't go any further than that, so you don't need to worry about that. I did find out that we can throw shit at him in order to slow him down. Which is great. But apparently, we need to go outside of the mansion. Or at least around here. And there's another hiding spot there. What? The bridge is destroyed! How could this happen? It's impossible to draw to jump across here. I'll have to find another way. <laughs> Shoot! What the Huh? The glass bead is gone! That crow must have taken it! I better head back to the mansion and look for the crow. There we go. Now we have to head up to the balcony and confront the crow. I'll grab something to throw along the way. Actually, while I'm thinking about it.
How are we going to teach it a lesson? Are we going to throw something at it? Just in case, you never know. It's always good to have at least two of everything important. Oh, you're... So this is where you went. I should throw something to scare it off. Uh... Oops, that might have been a little mean. Oh, it's got quite the collection. Wonder what's in here. Oh, a key! Maybe it's a key for this place. I'll hold on to it. First floor reception key. Was there another door on the first floor that was locked and I just don't remember it? Which can happen. have two of each importance. Oh, stairs. First floor. First floor reception room. Where is the reception room? Wrong button. Opens the reception room door. Where is the reception room? Seriously, where is it? I never went down these stairs. I'm a dumb. Some rations. Oh! Uh, it's, uh... Who's that? Is someone there? I finally found you, Arisa. Who are you? Ken? Or are you Bob? Hehehe. <laughs> Hehehe. Arisa! He! <laughs> finally! <laughs> you alright, Arisa? Bob! <laughs> you! Hey! You! Over there! Come get me! 
Bob! Damn you! Yeah! You... You'll pay for that! And he just disappears. Are you alright? Yeah, fine. No big deal. Anyway, I'm glad you're not hurt, Adisa. If something happened to you, Emily'd kill me. Thanks, Bob. You really saved me. Have you seen Emily and Ken? I haven't seen Ken yet, but I did find Emily. Our phones can't get a signal here, so we split up to look for you two. What have you been doing all this time? Oh, I was looking around to see if there was any way to get your power on. Good idea. It'd be a big help if it was on. I'll look too. Be careful, Arisa. After that thing just now, I'm pretty sure there's something weird going on with this place. Right. You be careful too, Bob. If anything happens, meet back at the secret room in the chapel. Okay, got it. Arisa. Yes? Um, sorry. I'm sorry things ended up like this. It's okay. But I'm going to get you back for this later, you know. <laughs> That's fair. Just be gentle. No, why did I turn that off? It's so dark without it. Hold on. I want to explore some more before coming in here. Stairs. And a door. Uh, I guess this door's locked from the other side. Okay, good to know. Let's check out this room. Another note. John was was bug the hell. John was bugging the hell out of me, so I nudged him with my elbow. He collapsed like I punched his slice out. Why is he so annoying? Day after 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 a lot of it. There's a letter and a book on the floor. Ahoy, Daniel. Thank you for using Kamehameha's. We finished installing the emergency generator in the BDSM room within the mansion basement as requested. The instruction manual has been provided. Electricity for the Hatake mansion can be recovered when activated, but the area of installation will be constipated, so use caution. Kamehameha Service, Inc. Looks like this book is the generator instruction manual. There's another note with the numbers on it. I wonder what they're for. Anyway, I bet if I activate the generator, then the electricity will come on. I'll go underground and check out the mine shaft. What's at this door then? Rations! And a hiding spot. I'll try to remember that. Restore electricity in the mine. You know, that would be helpful. Thank you, Dad. Rations here. Wait a minute. I think I get it. Every time there's fog in the area, he's around. So I can't quite go exploring just yet. I 
should take care of the uh, mine shaft first. It closed the window, right? Yeah, okay. Trying to keep noise down as much as possible. So I close the window. <sighs> Benefits to living in an apartment complex. I'm being sarcastic, by the way. Okay. I would have I would have had to have gone through Big Boy, but I would have been able to open the door from that side. Down we go, back into the mine shaft. So I'm, I I'm guessing that whenever that fog shows up, he's around. So I have to... I have to be careful, because... It, you know, it'd suck if he was in an area I had to go. You know? And it doesn't seem to... Like, running doesn't seem to change much. I don't bring him out sooner. He's gonna be in this area, isn't he? Looks like a combination lock. Wait, there's something written on the door. Emergency power generator had no trans. Oh! And maybe the combination is. It opened! So the numbers on the note were for this. Awesome. See a note. My important place. Here. My precious family. Here. Whoever gets in my way is dead. I will eliminate them. This has to be the spare generator. If I turn this on... Yes! Here's hoping the lights in the mansion turned on. I should go back and check. Yes, we should. After I save, because I'm paranoid. And if you give me the opportunity to save whenever I want, then I will take advantage of it. Come on, come on. Run, run, run. Now we got two things chasing me. Great.
I'm... Going here. To recharge. And yes, I noticed the fog. Which means I was right. Whenever there's fog in a certain... In an area... There's a possibility of being chased. We got three chasing us. Not two. Three. So I was right. If there's fog in the area, then there's a good chance we're going to get chased by one of them. You, Arisa. Gah! What? No, no way. Ah! Arisa, where are you? Uh, the door is open. Maybe I can escape through there. a big building way down there in the forest. Maybe I can learn something if I check it out. Or I'll stop by the secret room first so the others know. Thank you. Still fog here? No. No fog. Good. Locked. Unlocked. Oh boy. With the wrong, wrong stairs. Huh. 
hide, hide, hide. I need to hide. Or I just run as far. Eh! Huh? That was Emily's voice. It's coming from the chapel. You finally came. That makes me happy. Let go of her right now. Sure. Only if you take her place. No! This guy! He's not sane! Shut up! Stop it! Well, think hard. Call me when you decide. Though I'm not too sure this girl will be okay until then. <laughs> Now, if you could get out of the way. Smack the bitch from behind! I'll be waiting for your reply. <laughs> What's going on? Bob! What? You again? Damn you! Emily! What in the hell are you? <clears throat> you! That's enough! Cut it out! Get it! Damn it! Bob! <sighs> Bob! Oh, you finally woke up. Yeah, thought I'd take a nap. I was worried sick about you! Ow! Oh, sorry. It's fine. More importantly, did you gain weight? You dummy! Are you really okay? Don't worry, I just need to rest for a bit. And then I'll be good. Right, that's probably best. Who the hell was that anyway? I have no idea. Bob, thanks so much for saving me. Stop it, of course I would. We've got to do something so we can get out of here. Oh yeah, I almost forgot. I found a building in that forest that's ahead. We might be able to find a way to get out if we go there. Another building, so close to this one? Sorry, but could you go check it out? I will. You rest up, okay? Emily, could you stay here and watch over him? Yeah. Alright, I'm going now. Don't forget what happened earlier. Make sure you be careful. Yeah, you be careful too. I'm gonna cut a bitch. In the next episode. Until then... Well, yeah, in the next episode we'll head for the building. And I... Should definitely find another throwable. Until then, this is the Gamer Girl, signing off. Bye-bye.